Hello, everyone, and welcome to my Bachelor official YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. ABCC has launched a new promo featuring Bachelorette Jen Tran, who displays her emotional side. Fans are getting a better idea of what to expect as her season prepares to debut on Monday, July 8. Quite early on, one of the guys will inform her that not all of the guys are there for the proper reasons. What will she say? Continue reading to learn more. Jen Tran, the bachelorette, is already handling drama. There are already some cautions to Jen Tran about men in the mansion as the bachelorette premiere draws near. Aaron Herb informs Jen in the most recent ABC promo that not every man is there for the right reasons. Jen addresses the group after listening to Aaron's remarks. Are you here because this is a TV show? She asks them. She advised everyone to go if they felt that this was not the right place for them to be. That's not where it ends. One man tells Jen early on in a group date that he's already falling in love with her. In a confessional, she asks, how can you love me when you don't really know me? With emotion. One of the males tells someone in a different tape that they are too young to understand what love is. Maybe it's not in the cards for me to find somebody, Jen continues, starting to doubt her path. She later states that she must act in her own best interests. Then we see her setting down a single rose. What may be expected from Jen's season on the show? When she sets out on her adventure on Monday, everyone will need to pay attention. She disclosed that she was the third option. Jen Tran addressed reports that she was the third choice for the show in a recent interview. This is in reaction to claims made by Maria Jorgis and Daisy Kent that they were offered the part but turned it down. After hearing what Aaron has to say, Jen goes to address the group. She says to them, Are you here because this is a TV show? She told them all that if they think this is not the place they should be then, they need to get out. It doesn't stop there. While on a group date early on, one man tells Jen he's already falling in love with her. She emotionally says in a confessional, How can you love me when you don't really know me? In another clip, one of the men is telling someone they are too young to know what love is. Jen begins to question her journey and goes on to say, Maybe it's not in the cards for me to find somebody. Later she says she has to do what is right for her. She is then seen laying a single rose down. What will happen during Jen's season of the show? Everyone will have to tune in on Monday when she begins her journey. She addressed rumors she was the third choice. In a recent interview, Jen Tran also addressed rumors that she was the show's third choice. This is in response to both Daisy Kent and Maria Jorgas saying they were offered the role but declined. Jen shared that every year multiple women are interviewed for the job. She was one of them and was in talks well before it was announced by the network. She said they reached out to her finally and she accepted. Jen didn't comment further but her remarks appeared to throw shade at Maria. What do you think about the new trailer for Jen's season? Are you excited to watch? Stay tuned for more updates. Jen mentioned that several women are interviewed for the position each year. She was in negotiations long before the network made the announcement. She claimed that when they eventually reached out to her, she accepted. Jen remained silent after that, but it seemed like she was disparaging Maria. How do you feel about the most recent Jen season trailer? Are you eager to see it? Watch this space for additional developments. Fans of Bachelor Nation are reacting negatively to a joke that Caitlin Bristow made about her minor niece. To find out what she said, continue reading. Fans were not amused by Caitlin Bristow's latest social media post that exposed her underage niece. Bristow has never been afraid to share her personal details, but this post has brought her back to the fore. The former bachelorette posted a photo of herself and her niece toasting beverages to Instagram, 
explaining in the caption that they were sipping virgin cocktails during their celebration. Fans of Bachelor Nation didn't mind that the 16-year-old was sipping mocktails in the afternoon, but Caitlin's subsequent statement that they were commemorating a significant event in her niece's life sparked controversy. Public comments are not permitted on Caitlin's Instagram story, where the post was shared. Nonetheless, followers of Bachelor Nation reacted to the caption on Reddit. Fans of Bachelor Nation call it gross Caitlin Bristow's joke regarding whether or not her niece is a virgin offended a lot of Redditors, who took to the platform to ask other users what they thought and whether they agreed with the original poster's assessment that the caption was hella inappropriate. Check out some of the comments below. Other Reddit users swiftly joined in, concurring that Caitlin's post was offensive. The original poster additionally obscured the young girl's face with a face palm emoji. Call it a mocktail instead, and don't bring up a minor's virginity at all. Gross. I would be furious if my sister shared this about my minor child with her 1.8 million followers. She is an attention seeker, and she shared it knowing that people would be understandably upset. What a freak. A joke about a minor's virginity on a platform where hundreds of thousands of grown men follow you is fucking weird. I understand that she's playing off the virgin, but still, it's so inappropriate to say that it should not be posted. Who even is this? That's so inappropriate to say, especially about a minor. KB is gross. However, not everyone found the joke offensive. One person commented, are you kidding me? There are almost 200 comments on this. You guys, REL. The former bachelorette took to Instagram to share a celebration she had with her niece. The snapshot showed Caitlin and her niece toasting drinks. She clarified in the caption they were drinking virgin cocktails. Bachelor Nation fans didn't have a problem with the 16-year-old drinking mocktails in the afternoon but the next part of Caitlin's post raised eyebrows. She wrote that they were celebrating something big happening in her niece's life. Caitlin wrote, The post was shared on Caitlin's Instagram story, which doesn't allow for public comments. However, Bachelor Nation fans took to Reddit to share their reactions to the caption. Bachelor Nation fans call it gross. A lot of Redditors didn't appreciate Caitlin Bristow's joke about whether her niece is a virgin or not. One person who saw the post jumped on Reddit to ask others what they thought and if they agreed with the OP's assertion that the caption was hella inappropriate. The OP also blocked out the young girl's face with a face palm emoji. Other Reddit users quickly piled on, agreeing that Caitlin's post was gross. Check out some of the comments. Call it a mocktail instead and don't bring up a minor's virginity at all. Gross. I'd be beyond angry if my sister posted this about my minor child to her 1.8 meters followers. She is an attention seeker and posted this knowing people would be rightfully disturbed. Such a freak. A joke about a minor's virginity on a platform where hundreds of thousands of grown men follow you is fucking weird. How anyone could take a pause and not conclude, this should not be posted is lacking some good judgment here. I get that she's playing off the virgin, but still gives me the ick. Who even is this? That's so inappropriate to say, especially about a minor. KB is gross. But not everyone had a problem with the joke. One person wrote, Are you kidding me? There are almost 200 comments on this. You guys are ELX. It was a bad joke. It's gonna be all right. What do you think of Caitlin Bristow's post about her underage niece's virginity? Share your reaction in the comments. Comment below with your thoughts on Caitlin Bristow's post on her underage niece's virginity. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.